Hello friends, Marcy here, and I am excited to share with you a package that arrived yesterday from Atlas Stationers, and I love the little notes they put on the back of um, their cards, Spooktac Spooktacular Order, and of course it was. Um, once you see what's in the box, you'll know, no labels out here. Okay, so we have Waterman Paris. Um, this is my first Waterman pen. Um, my first pen from France as, as well. I have a lot of the sailor uh, Japanese pens and Germany pens, um, pens from all over. But this is my first Waterman. Um, sorry, the shadow from the natural light in the window is coming in from this. So I'm just going to quickly take this out of the box and move it aside. So let you enjoy the beauty before you. Let's zoom in here and look at some of this gorgeous color. Um, this is called Marine Amber. So the whole theme of this pen is um, has to do with marine boating. Uh, it is uh, the theme is designed um, with elements of a luxury yacht with a little shape here, the finial, the torpedo shape here on the cap. And I do know from reading information on it um, that this clip is 23 karat gold and it has a snap cap. Let's look inside um, to find the nib of 18 karat gold. And this is the gorgeous uh, inlaid nib design that I am very fond of. Um, as a matter of fact, I'm going to be doing some uh, sharing and comparing of some pens that I have that of a similar design and color. So on the nib, it does have the Waterman logo there. Um, 18K, I'm not sure if you're, that, you're picking that up. And 750 over here on this side. Um, you do not see the nib size uh, engraved on the nib, but it is on the back of the pen here at the breather hole. Let's see what we get here. If I can get this in for you, there's the F there right above the top of the breather hole there. So that's where your nib size is listed. Um, no matter what color you choose um, on the Karen um, model um, for the barrel. And by the way, this is a uh, brass metal um, pen. It's... Uh, lacquered and I I thought it was going to be like too heavy for me to not like because on the website it said it was 34 grams and where um this one is like 14 so and I really enjoy the weight of this pen so I was kind of concerned about ordering it uh, I just didn't want to have uh, a hefty pen but I'm pleasantly surprised at the weight. I'm mean, really enjoying that. And I'm excited to ink it up and write something with it. So going back into the pen. Um, let me cap it again and show you closely where it says around the band. Waterman. And the back says France. Okay. Um. Let me zoom back out to see the whole pen. But getting looking inside, we see that the pen does come with a converter and it is branded with the Waterman name. So it's probably um, proprietary. I'll have to find out. Um, it's not a screw in converter which I, I actually prefer um, but it does have a nice secure fit with like a little rubber plunger there on the end instead of plastic um, and let's peek inside the box again because uh, the box was shadowing the beauty of the pen and I just quickly moved it aside without showing you under the little pillow rest comes with the booklet 
with probably your warranty and care information. And it does come with a, a long um, cartridge. So I wonder what kind of ink they have in there. Maybe I'll ink it with the cartridge first. No, it's blue, and I don't want to use blue right now. Thank you for bearing with me as I uh, consider my choices out loud along with you. <laughs> All right, so I'm just anxious to ink this up. I'm not sure yet uh, which ink I will choose. Um, my Waterman ink that I do have is uh, Serenity Blue. And I have that inked in my Lamy 2000 now. But I, I don't think I want a blue ink right now for October with this gorgeous uh, amber pen. Um, I am considering colors of, it's the Monte Verde pumpkin cake. I think that would be gorgeous in here. Um, or my new sailor tea time let me show you i have not swatched this new ink it just arrived from atlas um about a week and a half ago and i haven't swatched it with you yet so i'm not sure but we'll get into some inks we'll get into some writing samples and share more about this gorgeous pen in a coming video thank you for spending some of your precious moments with me you have a blessed day bye-bye